Isaiah 58, 6 through 7 says, This is not the fast which I choose to loosen the bonds of wickedness, to undo the bands of the yoke, and to let the oppressed go free, and to break every yoke. Is it not to divide your bread with the hungry and bring the homeless into your house when you see the naked to cover him and not to hide yourself from your own flesh? Well, if you're joining us in reading through this 90-day reading plan, today's reading is Isaiah 58 and 59, and I encourage you to read that passage. Well, Isaiah returns to a message of comparison between that which is done and that which should be done. That which is done is based on religion, and that which should be done should be based on a relationship. Well, sometimes we who have a relationship with Christ live contrary to that relationship, all the while believing we are doing God's will. Isaiah shows this to the Jews. They do not fast because of repentance and a desire to serve. They fast so there might be retribution and glory. But we as believers have uh, no right to claim righteousness. The only right we have is to claim the unrighteousness and desire for repentance. It is we who need to change and not the rest of the world. And here's the reason why. The world is controlled by Satan and since it is a fall it has been ruled by death and sin. Therefore righteousness must be achieved on an individual basis and not on a corporate basis. The world itself cannot be righteous. Only those inside the world may achieve that. But it cannot be achieved if we think the same way as the world thinks. If we want retribution or payback, if we want to be the big person on campus, we're not functioning on a believing level. We are functioning on a sinful one. Isaiah's message, as was John the Baptizer's message, is one of repentance. We must change our focus from an outward view to an inward one. As that view changes, our lives will change. As we focus our lives more on Christ, so we focus our actions on serving the others rather than serving selfishness. We are not fasting to increase ourselves. We should fast to serve others. <music>